Everything's heavy, uh, everything's heavy, uh, everything's heavy, yeah, shit's real heavy, everything's heavy, uh, everything's heavy, uh, everything's heavy, yeah, shit's real heavy, everything's heavy, everything's heavy, everything's heavy, yeah, everything's heavy, yeah, shit's real heavy, everything's heavy, everything's heavy, everything's heavy, yeah, shit's real heavy. What's good, YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. Vlogging with Trey, man. Hey, if you here just watching the video, make sure you go ahead and like, subscribe, uh, click the post notification bell so you can stay up to date to when I post. Uh, about to head over to Freedom Cycle so I can grab me a um, helmet and some goggles for my four wheeler because I think we about to get out and ride tonight. And uh, I'll make sure I put the GoPro on so y'all can see all that action. But uh, yeah, after we get through picking up a helmet and some goggles. I'm gonna run down to the shop where the TA is and uh, check on the progress of that. I don't think it's been put on the the uh, lift just yet because um, there was a little mishap with some with some parts and stuff that I had to get. Um, so I got a couple more I gotta drop off to them. And um, we wanted to get all that stuff done while it was out of the car. So I'm gonna drop that off real quick. Hopefully he's there. I had called a couple times, so I don't know. We might not might not get a, a view of the TA in this video, but. I'm gonna go down there and check on it and uh, hopefully he's there but um so yeah i'm about to run up in freedom cycles now look at me a helmet get some goggles maybe get some gloves and stuff too and all that but um so after i get out of there um yeah i'll probably see y'all down at the shot where the ta is so man make sure y'all stay tuned keep watching the video like i said like share subscribe click that post notification bell now man and, uh, I'll see y'all when we get down to the shop where the TA is, man. All right, y'all. So I just left the shop, and uh, I didn't really—I didn't take my camera in because it really wasn't nothing to nothing to vlog. He had a couple couple new whips up in there that he was working on. Uh, I actually should have took it in there because he had a 2013 Camaro that uh, that was cam had I think the same exact cam as I have. So you kind of would have got a. I guess a little sneak preview on how mine would have sounded, but I didn't. Uh, I'm kind of in a hurry because I'm about to go out and ride four wheelers with my with my uh, with my cousin. So I didn't record nothing, but I think this week we're going in. Um, I, I, yeah, I think this week we're going in. If I'm not mistaken, either this week or this weekend coming. But regardless, we are going in. Um, everything's paid for. All the parts that I need are there. Um, so it shouldn't be any more holdups. So um, I still haven't got my radiator in yet, which that's not holding anything up. It's not going to prevent any installs or anything. But um, I need to get that in ASAP. But no worries. It'll be in here soon. I'm trying to think of anything else. I think that was it. But like I said, we about to go out and ride four wheelers, about to ride a couple trails. I forgot my my helmet mount um, at the house when I when I went and picked up my bike. So I gotta kinda figure out where I can mount my my GoPro for uh, for me to record. But if I don't get it get it uh, mounted and recorded, then I'll just catch y'all some other day when I'm uh, recording something else. But heading out to meet my cousin now. I'll get a video of his bike and uh, we're meeting up with a couple other people so I get a couple videos of they bike and everything show y'all show y'all how we rolling on these trails and stuff I don't even know where we're going to ride trails but I'll try to figure out something so that I can get some footage for it but I'll see y'all here in a few few minutes when we get out there man alright alright y'all so it's a new day and um I forgot to bring my GoPro with me um, the other day when we rode, when we was out riding four wheelers, actually I didn't forget the GoPro. I forgot the mount for my um for my helmet, and um there was just nowhere for me to mount it. So we just ended up riding trails around the city. I didn't even know we even had trails in the inner city, which is crazy. But we ended up riding, and uh man, that was probably the most fun I'd have had in a while. Look, I got my boy Slick over here riding the four wheel. Hey, I need that help. I need that help. 
said you need the helmet. I need that helmet. Where is it at? It's right there on the thing. I need that motherfucker though. What'd you think about the uh, four wheeler though? Huh? What'd you think about it? I'm gonna <laughs> get me one when I get my check. <laughs> <laughs> no, for sure not. Yeah, but it's a nice day. I got my bra out here. So I decided to bring my um, Caprice out just so I can clean it up a little bit. I haven't washed it since I had it. I got to get me some uh, steel wool so I can clean these wheels up. I ain't going to keep them. But I just want to clean them up. No, Kevin. This shit look nasty. But I ain't even know it was bubbling right here. Probably right, some rust up under there. Trunk all nasty. I'm cleaning the trunk out right now. I don't even know how to ship gears. But I'm cleaning the trunk out right now. Seeing what all type of junk is up in here. I pulled these. 312, I think, the, yeah, them 12s. Pull them 312s out. And, um, I have to throw all this shit away. See if I can get a better look. Look at this. I think last time when I showed it, it was sunny out, but it wasn't bright. So here's a bright look at it. Can't even recline the seat. This nigga got dog food, all type of shit in here. But need a new dashboard, glove box cover. I need a whole bunch of shit for this car. Ah, to the for real, for real. When I bought it, it didn't seem like a lot. But now that I actually have it and I'm looking at everything, I'm kind of thinking maybe I'm about to just sell this thing. Cause. When I look back at all the money I didn't put into the TA, I'm not really trying to do that. I thought I was just about to get a car and, you know, have to change a little bit of the interior, paint, wheels, but, bro, this thing got rust all on it. I don't know. Probably just part it out. Because I doubt anybody actually pays what I want or give me back the money that I paid for it. I don't know. We'll see. Um, I'm st I, I go through these little spurts where I want the car, then I don't want the car. Then I want the car again, and I want to, I don't know. We'll see. As of right now, I'm just, I don't know. I'm one of them people that like, for some reason when my cars are dirty, I don't want them. But as soon as I wash them and clean them up and everything, then I change my mind. So that's what I'm doing right now. I'm just cleaning it up. Is that a mouse? Oh, no, I was about to say. But no, I'm just, um. I'm just cleaning it up right now about to wash it had to pull it out with my truck because you know it don't run need to find somebody to come over here and get it started for me but um i like it i like the car it's just little this small shit about it that pisses me off like like this right here i don't even know where i'm gonna find another inner fender at because it's metal and then everybody that has an actual fender for it they tell me a price, but then when I'm ready to send the money, they just quit communicating. So, look, this don't even go to the car. This mirror does not go to the car. That is crazy. But, I don't know, man. Like I said, I'm about to clean it up. Hopefully my mind changes. See, it actually look good from this angle. I ain't gonna lie to you. Just imagine that thing lifted a little bit in the front and then squatted in the rear end with a fire-ass paint job. I don't know, y'all. I really don't know. Like I said, look, here's a trim piece. Like, it's broken. I'm gonna keep it, though, just in case I need it. It's all wired up for beat. 12s came out, but it ain't nothing. Nothing hooked up. I need to get a back. Oh, this thing used to be green. It's an ugly ass green. Like, ugly as fuck. But I had I had somebody over here. Um, look at this thing. I have a two back one. Riding this 
shit out of first gear. He don't even know how to shift. He riding the shit out of first gear. But uh, I had somebody pull up. Um, I had Tavion from uh, Tavion's Garage. I, shout out to him. Y'all follow his channel and shit. He's got a um, Caprice just like mine that he's building. He's LS swapping it. But I had him pull up and um, put a starter on this. Um, Cause I was about to, I was about to put a battery and all that, and try to start it up, but it was in the garage. And um, this thing been sitting so long; it's got old gas in it. I didn't, I just didn't want it. I just didn't want anything to happen, like as far as the old gas, and then I don't know. I just, I just didn't trust it being in my garage trying to crank. So he put the starter on, and um, that's that's like literally the only thing I've done to it. Look, finally got the trunk open. This thing was all messed up, still messed up. <laughs> Corona. But, uh, I'm just cleaning this stuff up. And, uh, about to wash it and i'll just show y'all see it well i'm gonna show y'all what it looked like after i wash it we'll see if it actually cleaned up or anything because it doesn't look like it's about to actually clean up at all but i don't know we'll see in a minute so i'll show y'all here in a minute y'all all right y'all so i just got through cleaning up or cleaning out the um the spit uh the trunk um i mean it cleaned up a little bit It ain't spotless like I want it to be, but I'm gonna end up going to um, Home Depot and buying one of them shop vacuums. Um, tried to get the creases and crevices as much as possible, but all I had was a broom. I was just sweeping and using the dustpan. But um, it cleaned up all right, or cleaned out all right. There's a bunch of wires that are not on all the way. I don't know, it look like they didn't got seized on there like the plastic thing got melted together so uh, i don't know i'm kind of for real for real and I, I i didn't clean it out and i'm really considering just cleaning it up real good and and posting it for sale no lie i don't know if somebody comes to me right now with with the right amount of money i will probably i will probably take it and that's just that's just the truth. I know there's somebody out there that probably doesn't have a project car or probably been on one of these and they actually don't mind putting the work into it. I see the vision. I know what I could do to it, but it's just, it's just a lot right now. Like the Trans Am is just getting done. Y'all don't even know how much I didn't spent on that. And over half of that for this car would just be paint and wheels. Not even including the motor, suspension, rear end, interior, none of that. So, I don't know. I'm kind of, I don't really want it to just sit in my garage for years. Like, if it's going to do that, I need, it to, I need it at least running so I can move it. But, I don't know, man. And then my boy Slick was just here. And my four-wheel is messed up for real now. So, it was all, it already had problems with um my rear axle bearings i did that last weekend when uh we was riding trails i ended up one of them's busted so i was just gonna end up um replacing both of them this weekend but i don't know what it is now I don't, it's leaking oil i don't know if it didn't all leaked out or what but it's leaking out right here and i don't know what that is right there i have no clue like i don't know if there's a plug there or or what but it's got oil everywhere like man i don't know then i need a new clutch for it too it's still rising there y'all see he was just riding but he was like going crazy in first gear so i don't know if it just built up a whole bunch of oil pressure and did something to it i don't know but it's leaking oil now so 
I don't know. I'm about to just clean it up, clean up the, the Caprice. I don't know. Go from there. See what happens next. But, um, I don't know. This is probably going to be a short video. Just giving y'all a little rundown of how my day is going. And, um, I don't know, man. I'll probably see y'all the next one with some better news or something like that. But until then, like, share, subscribe, comment, do all that. Um, hit the post notification bell so you'll see when I post again. And uh, until then, I'll see y'all the next one, man. All right, y'all. We ain't going to end the video there just yet. So I, um, I got it pulled out. Started cleaning it up a little bit. And I ain't going to lie, man. This thing actually looks good, bro. Actually looks good. I'm, I think I'm going to keep it. <laughs> I'm one of them people that will see a dirty car and really not like it. Like, to the point I'll be wanting to get rid of it. And then once I see it clean, I don't know, then I gain some type of motivation. But I'm going to go ahead and uh, set the camera up, and then we're just going to finish uh, washing, the, washing the car and the bike. All right, y'all, see, I see it. Actually cleaned up good. The chrome, it shines all right. I could, I'm, I'm going to polish it. I don't think I'm going to detail the uh, paint, but it actually did clean up pretty good. I'm going to put some um, steel wool to the, to the chrome wheel so that the chrome can start shining again. Probably take out those um, inserts. See if I can find just some regular cap inserts for it. But I ain't gonna lie, I cleaned up pretty decent. It's starting to rain a little bit. But I'm about to go ahead and uh start cleaning up and then get this four-wheeler and all that stuff put up. But